How did you get the idea for the Kindness Project, and why did you assign it? Um, the idea for the Kindness Project came to me over Christmas break because I feel like Christmas is such a time where we care about what we get and showing off what we got, and I really wanted my kids to think about others after kind of the season of excess. I'm excited to see kind of the mashup of all of the Kindness Projects together. We got to watch each of them individually, but putting them all together is really going to show people outside broadcast what really we try to do in here. You gotta open it. It's a nice message. The acts of kindness. Everyone deserves to be happy, especially you. Oh, that's so sweet. Yes. Aww. That's for you, so you can keep that. Oh, thank you. You guys You're are welcome. so sweet. Have a nice welcome. night. Thank you. So, Riley, I first met you two years ago. It was my first show, and it was yours as well. I have no idea who you were or what to think of you. <laughs> However, we didn't really talk to each other until this past summer. Since that time, you have become one of my best friends. I'm so glad I decided to do HDA with you because you made made and the friendship we've created. I just wanted to tell you how much truth I truly appreciate our friendship. Oh. <laughs> practicing counting coins? Yeah. Hi, I'm Quinn Spaulding. Join me on the journey of kindness. This one, I'm gonna have to take my shoes off. Okay. Ready? What? We are back, and the bathroom is finally complete with a couple hours of hard work.
last but not least, shout out to my boy Javi. After the students presented their videos in class, what was your reaction to them? As with any student assignment, I think that some waited until the last minute and didn't put in full effort, but some were amazing. And people went above and beyond to be kind and thoughtful and creative, and that's why I like teaching this class, because students really get a chance to kind of express themselves.